Hey guys, it's Kinky Monkey here. I apologize for this, this thing right here. It's something in my camera. Can't get rid of it. Tried cleaning it. I think it's inside the lens. I'm not too sure. Um, as long as my light is correct, it won't be too much of a problem. It's not like if I have this light glowing, it's going to make that little thing really bad, you know. It's cool. I like this light. It's awesome light for where I do my painting, so it's like, move around, you know, whatever I need to do. Anyways, uh, yeah, so I apologize for this light, uh, I'll probably be here from now on, um, whenever I do a video for my built-in webcam, but anyways, back to the, the reason for this video. Um, so I don't know if any of you are familiar with the store, Five Below, the store where everything is $5 or below uh it's a really nice store i like it but uh, anyways i went out friday i believe uh friday or saturday i picked up some led supplies all, all the supplies i thought i needed and i bought a cheap gun i bought the mega dart la six launcher from uh five below which is kind of like a wannabe busby brand i know so it's very redundant it's like a wannabe wannabe nerf brand um, it's just like the Tech 6 from Busby, but it's different colors, and the interior is a little different, kind of a bit more awkward. And the outside, I kind of, I do like the paint job better. It does look cooler, because it came in either red or blue. I think it's like the third generation Tech 6, I think that's what I heard. But anyways, this is, the warning is, well, I took the gun apart, painted it, got it all ready to put a, an LED in it. Didn't have the right LED parts, not all of them were good, whatever. Um... So then I looked up on things online, you know, how people modded their Tech Sixes. They did a basic AR removal. Removal. So I was like, okay, I'll do AR removal. Hammer away, thinking oh, this is more awkward than it should be. Um, I finished it, put it back together, went to go test starts, and it was awkward. All right, first this is how my um, gun came out. I didn't do any detailing. I was going to do some more detailing on these things. Put some white in there. I don't know, I don't feel, I don't like the, this is the, the glossy black, don't like the glossy black, so I'm going with the flat back black from now on, like my Spartan shot is, Spartan shot, flat black, very nice, very nice, uh, doing more to this, so excited for the, uh, the Orange Mod Ricks, uh, long shot kits that I have heard have been revealed, three different types. I don't know much about that. I got the information from Germ. If you're watching this, you have to know Germ because I'm a low time nerf. It's like me, German Drac, you know. Anyways, back to the video. So this is my gun. Uh, these are the Busby darts, or the darts it came with. It goes in. I took with with the AR. You pretty much you take out all these little posts. There were pain in the butt to get out uh, as you can see it took some work so I took those out you put the darts in you know it's it's loose it's awkward before they fit perfectly you know whatever so put three of them in do a little testing for you So, yeah, as you can see, it's not firing. I mean, it is, but as you can see, boo! So, uh, this is just a warning video to any of you who happen to buy the Mega Launcher 6, or Mega Dart Launcher 6 from 5 Below. Um, works great. Worked really well. I liked it. But, but I didn't. the one thing I didn't like is when you buy it, you shake it, you can hear it. It's how it's always been. That's how it's been since I bought it. You can hear all the parts inside moving, not properly secure. This thing, it goes everywhere. It's just, I don't like that. But, I mean, the, the cotton, it's a cool gun. kind of looks like a big fish. Reminded me of the, uh, the razor fin, just without the awesome fin parts. Um, but, yeah, um, awkward. If you buy this gun, want to mod it, might have modding potential, I don't know doesn't have AR, do not do not remove the air restrictors, uh, they seem more like dart posts, you need those, alright, 
Um, it's what makes the gun actually work. I checked the air compression, took this out, I felt it. Air compression, really, really good air compression, you know? Like, you know, I, feel, I don't know if you could see this at all, but it, when I let go, that's when it fully came back. It's awkward. Um, I'm gonna see if I can turn this into a single shot. I don't know. But just a warning to you, common courtesy warning. Do not remove the posts. Horrible idea. Won't make will make your gun not work anymore. So I'm gonna see about maybe putting a Maverick barrel in here. See if that works. Not barrel, but you know what I mean. Um, don't know. Uh, maybe throw an update at you later. All right. Thanks for watching.